Hello, YouTube. Welcome back. I'm so glad you decide to continue to join me. <laughs> Let's roll through it quickly, shall we? If you are new here, please subscribe. Watch Buffy with me. It's, it's fun. It's fun for me, at least. <laughs> also, subscribe to my main channel. That will be linked down below. If you want to watch full reactions to Buffy, I'm doing that on my Patreon. You can find that link down below. I upload there every Tuesday, whereas here, who knows? Who knows? But you guys are so understanding with that, so thank you. And last but not least, no spoilers in the comments, please. I do have a lovely mod looking over everything before I come in and chat with you on the comments, but, you know, just to make their job easier, no spoilers in the comments. Appreciate that. Appreciate all of you. Enjoy the reaction. Off we go. We are on episode nine. That is, like, so far. That's... I feel like season one is almost over, it's coming to an end, and it's like kind of making me sad a little bit. I'm acting like I don't have any more seasons to do after this one ends. This is it. I'm kidding. It is a beautiful sunny day out today. No storms. No storming. That's a good thing. I feel much better. <laughs> about this day. I'm in a good mood. It's sunny. I've got my iced coffee. So fuck it. Let's just get into it. I will be home. <laughs> no, no. I just got flashbacks to doing Evil Dead commentary. You know how it starts off with the heavy breath. Why is breathing so scary? It's fine. It's fine. It's literally fine. It's just breathing. Ballet is fun. Ballet is fun. Trombones are fun. Is that a trombone? It is now. <laughs> Dolls are not fun. If it isn't the great producer. Had to see this to believe it. Oh, you three. The school talent show. How talent show. He thought it would behove me to have more contact with the students. Uh, I did <laughs> try to explain that my vocational choice of librarian was a deliberate attempt to minimize said contact, but uh, he would have none of it. They obviously have no idea that he literally hangs out with the students every day. And at night, they have extracurricular activities they do together. <laughs> but this works too. I think maybe we better leave our Mr. Giles to this business he calls show. Poor Roop. It's about Snyder. So, we think school events are stupid, and we think authority figures ought to be made fun of. No, no, we don't. Um, well, in I think I just found three eager new participants for the talent show. <laughs> what? No. <laughs> Rube's gonna be like, <laughs> oh, I hope Sanders sings. For all that touchy-feely relating nonsense, but he was eaten. You're in my world now. And Sunnydale has touched and felt for the last time. Sorry? Did he just say he was, but he was e eaten? Okay, let's go back. What? They just, they're just gonna acknowledge it. That's probably for the best. That's... My predecessor, Mr. Flutie, may have gone in for all that touchy-feely relating nonsense, but he was eaten. You're in my world now. <laughs> Dale has that is my favorite line of the entire season now. I'm sorry. He just said, but he was eaten. You're in my world now. You're in my world now. <laughs> I just appreciate that so much. But new guy's kind of rough around the edges, huh? He doesn't have bags under his eyes. He sleeps at night. Anyway, talent show. Xander's not going to sing. I, well, see, I'm hoping what happens is at the end, what if he comes out with some, like, actual talent? What if Xander has a talent? You know, that feels a little Disney. <laughs> so maybe not. But we'll see. I think dummies are cute. You don't? Oh. Hi, I'm Morgan. And I'm Sid. Don't I didn't in. sleep at all last night. All right. Time out. I'm not gonna either if you keep fucking talking with that doll. Kid, you are the worst. Even I can see your lips move. Cut them. Dolls? On, like, just in general dolls? Are no for me. Ventriloquist dolls? Triple no for me. 
They're so fucking scary. Why do they need to exist? They don't. They don't. Who the fuck just thought one day, Noah would be cool if I put a doll and then talk as it? No. I wish I was around. I would have said, that doesn't sound cool to me. Don't do it. Is the doll... They zoomed in on his eyes. Is the doll gonna be the villain this episode? No. Why does the show do this to me? Maybe Roop will cut him from the show. He's not very talented. <clears throat> I wanna see her perform, to be honest. Flash. A dramatic scene is the easiest way to get through the talent show because it doesn't require an actual talent. Oh, they're going in as a group. They're just going to do a group project. You know what? That's probably smart. Look at the goodies. Morgan, you're really getting good. No, he's not. Once you go wood, nothing's as good. Okay, Morgan, we get the joke. You might want to consider getting some new shtick. Unless you want your prop ending up as a Duraflame log. Burn it. Burn it. I'll help. Kindling? I'm a great gatherer of kindling. Suicide, missing persons, spontaneous cheerleader combustion. That's what I'm saying! <laughs> Oh my god, the fact that they're just straight up addressing it is incredible. He's actually, you know what, he's pretty brave to come to a school like that. To be honest, I wouldn't accept that job. The last principal got eaten. That just feels like a job I wouldn't want, you know? So, you know what, maybe he's a little bit of a hard ass, but he knows what he's coming into, you know? He's very aware. Clean, orderly. Jesus, fuck. Oh yeah, someone just died. Emily, dancer Emily? Oh, I don't get to see her dance. I hate the school. Me too. But demons have claws and teeth. They got no use for a big old knife. Was there any blood on that knife? Human hearts, but... Is there any blood on that knife? Oh yeah, okay, maybe <laughs> real quick. <laughs> Just for the purpose of seeing if there's blood on the knife. Oh yeah, okay, I see. <laughs> Confirmed. One with the dummy? What's his name? Morgan? Yeah, that's it. He was acting kind of strange. That fucking doll's killing people, I know it. She was dancing. Sid and I were talking. Talking. Rehearsing. Put it in that fucking suitcase and let's toss it over a bridge. It's okay, Sid. We're done. Yeah, get him in there. I'll grab the duct tape. We could set up a complex sting operation where we get him to confess. I should wear a wire. Whoa, hey, you guys, all we know is that- She watches true crime shows. Same. That's why I said the duct tape thing. All right. I'll pull up his locker number. Can I still wear a wire? <laughs> he just wants to be a little rat. <laughs> Principal Snyder. Oh fuck, he's on it. It's gonna be tough with him around. Oh, I don't do any of those things. Not ever. There's something going on with you. There's something going on with you. You know what? It's probably just because I'm sus of everyone in this show now, especially after the angel thing we don't talk about for now. But like this principal, I feel like he's got more airtime in the first 16 minutes of his first episode than the last principal got in the eight prior. Wait, when did he die? Whichever one he died in. So either they're really pushing him down our throats because he's just it's just gonna be different it's kind of funny to like highlight the issues of the school and kind of like poke fun at them 
Or what if he dies? No, he's not going to die. Well, he might. <laughs> I don't care. I don't like him. It's just a little weird that he's he's so there. He's probably not going to die. <laughs> but it makes me feel weird. He must have taken it and just forgotten to tell me. You got a whole case in your locker? My locker was small. <laughs> I only got a top half. I didn't get a full length locker. Sure wouldn't have been able to put a case in there. Two binders and a whole fuckload of coffee mugs. You saw what she did, how strong she is. I know, but she's the last. Just this one more and I'll be free. Fuck off. I won't. I will. Oh, you, I, I w I hate this. I hate it. 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 I want to go back to the demon rhino. I don't want this. He's so scary. Why is his voice like that? Okay. It's going to be okay. Buffy will chop his head off, hopefully. I, s I think we should put him in the suitcase and, you know, like we discussed before. If he just didn't talk like that, he would be less... No, he wouldn't. No. There's just a lot going on right now. Well, get some sleep. You'll feel better in the morning. Good plan. Can you sleep with a brain in your hair? I like the pink. Fuck you. I'm not coming back. So much for the good mood and the sunny day. Yeah, I know it's there, I know it's there, I know it's there. It's not gonna scare me, it can't hurt me, it's just a doll. Ah! Holy fuck, it just went for it. Hey, what is it? In the bed, in the covers, there's something. Where? There's something there. After... I'm sorry I got you up. Don't worry about it, I was dreaming about bills. Relatable. You know what? Magicians love. More people should be magicians and less people should be ventriloquisters. It was Sid, the dummy. Or possibly the nightmare of somebody who had dummies on her mind. Can I have a little support here, please? I'm not just some crazy person. I'm the slayer. The dummy slayer? There's nothing funny about that. No. It's not so hard to believe she's killed big- there's been big bugs and stuff. Every seven years, these demons need human organs, a, a brain and a heart, to maintain their humanity. Otherwise, they, they, they revert back to their original form, which is uh, uh, slightly less appealing. Oh my god, it's like- it's like a demon scavenger hunt. Which, in one sense, established the U.S. as a local- Fucking turn its head. Don't turn its Looks like someone digs you. That's adorable. You and the dummy could tour in the freak show. Okay, corn dog, you don't see anything weird about that? This is Jackson. Morgan. <laughs> you said you'd give me Oh, of course. Oh yeah, you're not Oh my god, it's not gonna be there. Please be there. Just I don't wanna run it around. Unsupervised. It's gone. Gone? Where is he? Where is he? <laughs> Hi, Buffy. Hi, Willow. Xander, what the fuck? Red Rob. Red Rob. <laughs> that looks more comfortable. Close the eyes. We've got to get in that habit. Principal Snyder. My guy? Looking. Okay, he's so sus, right? He's so sus. What is he doing? Why is he always around? I forgot about him. 
like five minutes since he hasn't been on screen. Why does he lurk like that? Oh my god, you know what? I'm glad it's him and that it's not that fucking doll. It's already jump scared me once. And that's that's my max. That's I'm at full capacity for doll jump scares. <laughs> but what the hell's up with this guy? Can't figure him out. Look at that shot though, he looks scary. For something? Yes. Have you seen Morgan Shay? It's on the loose. On rare occasions, inanimate objects of human quality, such as dolls and mannequins, already mystically possessed of consciousness, have acted upon their desire to become human by harvesting organs. Morgan? Is Morgan gonna be okay, or are we gonna have to, like, kill him? Couldn't have brought like a flashlight. <gasps> was he harvested? Demon's got himself a brain. He was harvested. Oh my god, if he reds in on like a bicycle and asks her if she wants to play a game, I'm fucking done. I'm ending this episode. I'm sorry. You lost, and now you'll never be human. Yeah, well, neither will you. Why? What? what? <laughs> that was a curse. And the next thing I know, I'm not me anymore. I'm sitting on some guy's knee with his hand up my shirt. And ever since then... I get the, like, wanting to learn and, like, understand. But, like, maybe we don't just sit around and have a story time with the doll. Just a suggestion. Kill the doll. If I can get the last one, the curse will be lifted and I'll be free. I'm sure it's someone in that stupid talent show. Yeah, but now the demon has what he wants, he'll be moving on. So once care. we know who's missing from the show... We'll know who our demon is. We have to team up with the doll now? <laughs> okay, um, start pulling everyone's addresses in the talent show. I don't trust it. Then we can see who's a no-show. Um, uh, the what? The power circle. Here we go, forming circles again. I knew a slayer in the 30s. Korean chick. Very hot. They're talking muscle tone. Man, we had some times. I just don't, I just don't like this. Should we be telling him everything? I don't think so. Oh, that's that then. Um, everybody, uh, get ready. I hate that I haven't figured this out by now because I have been way too fucking scared this entire episode. I don't, like, is it the principal? <gasps> no one's missing. So the demon isn't in the show. It seems not. Uh, tell the others, look, it's nearly cut. I've been sus of him. Knew he was weird. But why would the demon have rejected the brain? I mean, I thought Morgan was the smartest kid in school. All A's. He was even taking college classes. Wait a second. What? All these sick days. Check the school nurse's file. That's so invasive. <laughs> cancer ward. Brain cancer? That's why he had all the headaches. This means that whatever's out there still needs a healthy, intelligent brain. In other words, I'm safe. And it's going to be looking for the smartest <laughs> person around. <laughs> you sure are. Willow. What? Willow's brain. Or Roop. Willow, Roop, both great brains. Ugh, Giles can handle himself. I mean, he is really... Smart. Smart? Giles! Ooh. Holy fuck, Giles! Sh what the hell, man? My neck? No. You were too trusting. He's just gonna straight up take his brain. Not Mark. Like what? Ah. Oh. Nice. Love that move. Ew. <laughs> <laughs> Concentrate. Holy shit. <laughs> wow. Good job, Xander. 
favorite part of the episodes are watching Buffy just like kick ass. <laughs> Happening. Fucking excuse me? Damn, dog. Let go! You're gonna. Let me. I got it. Yeah, you know what? You handle that. I'm not sad, but also I just, I think we should still put him in the case. Duct tape it. River. I'm not taking part of this sentimental moment. I'm not. <laughs> it's over. It's over. Oh my God. What do you do? Think quick. I don't get it. What is it? Avant-garde? <laughs> I'm just kidding. I know that there's a credit scene, I was told. <laughs> oh, why did I think that would be so funny? <laughs> I'm such an asshole. Okay, let's watch. But surely I must fear my mother's bed. Oh, Oedipus, Oedipus, unhappy Oedipus, that is all I can call you and all that I ever shall call you. Oh, Willow. He's dipping. Well, I fucking hated that episode. <laughs> I barely even drank my coffee. I was so scared. My hands are so sweaty. Nope. Not a fan. Don't like dolls. Don't even like that it ended up being on our side, kinda. Uh, nope. Hard no for me. I could do without any more dolls. Ever again. This episode during the storm last time would have killed me. I would have had to stop. I know it. The new principal, though, I'm still sus of him. I'm not sorry that I suspected him. He still feels off to me. Proud of Xander this episode. He had some moments. He caught the rope, saved Roop's life, basically. So, I mean, hey, he's pulling his weight. Appreciate that. I was really all over the place there. I had no idea what was going on 90% of the time. I was all over the place with my guessing. I didn't know what was going to happen, yet it was funny. I laughed a lot. There was a f I don't like when they make me laugh while I'm scared because what the fuck? That's too many emotions for me to handle. <laughs> One at a time. One emotion at a time. That was fun though. I just I just really hope we get back to vampires soon because these villains of the day type episodes are getting worse. I just let let me go back. I wanna go back to giant bugs and men in black and Lion King and hyenas. I those were those were good times. <laughs> anyway, I will see you in the next one.